Hi guys, today I will show you how to make a shakes like JRY Media. Note, I'm not 100% sure how JRY is making them, but, I will make almost the same as his shakes. Create a new adjustment layer. Go 4 frames backward and cut there this layer. From the middle, go 8 frames forward and cut the layer. Add motion tile on adjustment layer. Now go to very end of the adjustment layer and click on tile center stopwatch icon to create a keyframe. Press U on your keyboard to see the created keyframe. Then go to very beginning of the video and bring the anchor point down like this. Go to the center of your two clips and move anchor point up a bit. Go a few frames forward again and move anchor point down. Note, do not move too much, or your shakes will look so weird. First step is ready. Enable motion blur on adjustment layer now. Add one more effect, directional blur. Go to very beginning of the layer and click on blur length stopwatch icon. Change blur to 45. Then go to the center where your two clips are and change blur length to zero. Shakes are ready. Let me show you another cool shake effect that JRY uses in his videos. I will leave this effects as it is and will add one more effect. Before adding one more effect, let's stretch this adjustment layer. 10 frames backward and 10 frames forward. Now press U on your keyboard to see all keyframes, select all of them then hold ALT button on your keyboard and stretch keyframes. Correct directional blur keyframes, so the second keyframe should be in the center where two clips are. Add optics compensation effect. Toggle on reverse lens distortion. Go to very beginning of the video and change FOV to around 80 or 90. Click on FOV stopwatch icon. Then go to very end of the layer and change FOV to 0. Now you know how to make two shake effects that JRY uses in his videos. Note, those shakes aren't the same but they are very close to his shakes. Write in comments what do you think about it. If this video gets 500 likes, I will drop more of JRY's shake effects. Hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and like the video please.